This video will show you how to perform stereo measurement with the IPLEX NX video scope. When you find damage in places like the inside of a turbine engine, you need to measure it. The most important thing you need to do is take a good image from the right distance. First, I'll turn on the spot ranging feature. These five points tell me the distance from the surface to the tip of the scope. The spot ranging is green, so I'm good to go. I can freeze the image to determine if it's good enough to measure, or go straight to measurement. First, I need to find the length of this crack. Now, I'll go into measurement mode. Because I want to measure the length of this crack, I'll select distance measurement. This box tells me what steps to take. So now I'll place the first point and fine tune the placement with subpixel zoom. Tapping the arrows moves the cursor. Here is where I want my first point. Press enter to select. The point I selected is correctly matched on the second image, so I'll continue. This center box is telling me to select my second measurement point. Press enter to select. Check that the points are matched on both images. Here are my results. My stereo measurement result is green, so I know it's reliable. If my stereo measurement result is yellow, and I can't get closer to the surface for green, the best practice is to repeat the measurement a few times and take an average. Now I'll take a picture of the results. My stereo image is saved. I'll be able to see the results later, repeat my measurements, and even perform other modes of measurements on this image. Thanks for watching. To learn more about how to use the IPLEX NX video scope, contact your local representative or visit our website.